Hello, so we are back in Seoul Station, and um, this time we're heading to Daegu. Um, I'm gonna see my friend Keiko, who I haven't seen in a long time, and then honestly, we're just hitting a bunch of cafes because the Daegu cafe scene is amazing, and that's what I wanna do. So I'm gonna grab a granola bar, and then it's time to board our train, so. Hello, we have successfully made it to Daegu. I took the train to Dongdaegu Station and right before I got off, my friend posted an Instagram story that she was on the KTX going to Busan and I was like what the heck so I messaged her like oh I'm in car five and then she never opened it never replied and so all of a sudden this person I didn't have anyone sitting next to me all of a sudden this person sits down and it's my friend she walked from car 18 all the way to me it was so funny so this trip has already started off so great um, I only thought I was gonna see one friend on this trip but here we are Sung Young coming in clutch um, so now we are walking to a cafe to get some coffee and sustenance and that's the plan. Welcome to Daegu. Okay, so we are at Cafe Ingu right now, and <clears throat> it's right next to the medicinal street. There's like a huge street in Daegu um, that is devoted to like oriental medicine. And so it's just dead quiet, and it smells so strongly of like all the really good oriental medicine. And it's just really nice. And I got a latte, which I normally don't do. It's delicious. I'm sitting outside in a short sleeve t-shirt so yeah i'm going to eventually get food but for right now i'm just gonna sit and read and write and that is that is the entire agenda for the next couple hours so see you at our next stop Like literally this town is just all cute cafes. Wait, there's a baby gate. Does that mean that there's a dog? <gasps> Show yourself. <gasps> oh my God. Can you see through my shadow? There is a dog. A little fox. to feel in heaven when my lover's near Lord let this moment last for another year Though today has ended the night's still young I'd say Lover don't go away Let it be the thing that I am longing for Let's fly out from Manhattan to the California Hello, I'm wildly full. I'm about to go into a food coma. 
that was one of the most delicious sandwiches I've ever had. It was like a chili shrimp. I don't know. It was so good. And then I got their carrot soup, which was also amazing. But then they kept offering me more bread. They were like, do you want more? Like they gave you a side of bread. I was like, no, you don't understand. Like I am so full. So anyway, that was delicious. So now we're going to just head back. We're pretty much just staying in the Van Wildang area. Just gonna hit a couple little stores and uh, try not to fall asleep from so many cars, so. the first time I've ever been to Daegu where I'm not sweating profusely I think I always come here in summer and I don't know why because it's known like by locals and everyone alike that Daegu is like a very hot place um, so I am so pleased to be here on like a semi semi chilly day it's raining in a lot of other parts of Korea but here we're good so it's just kind of like chilly and lovely and spring like so Anyway, let's continue our shopping. moving to Daegu and I'm gonna live in this apartment spa complex. <laughs> I love it. I really wanted to get something from this ceramic studio, make a pottery, and I got a little candlestick, which I'm very excited about. They were super sweet. So now we're gonna go, it's actually getting a little toasty, if you can't tell by the sweat on my forehead. So we're gonna go to a cafe that I really like in Daegu because they have, the owners have a giant golden retriever. And that's all I travel for is coffee and dogs and friends. <laughs> so let's go see him. Tour. Bathroom. Voila, the toilet lights up. I don't know why. 
Um, lots of storage. You come in and you have your living room, bedroom. Really cute sized kitchen. Really cool view. There's Daegu Tower way the heck over there. And then your TV vanity. And you got a loft, which I don't need. Um, but you got two more beds up there. The room. I'm gonna take a quick nap before I see Keiko. And I will catch you then. Bye. Okay, gang, let's go get Keiko and dinner. Just spot a Daegu otter. A famous Daegu. Come back. I'll say I saw it if you say you saw it. That dog saw it for sure. If you didn't get the <laughs> it was the solving. Yeah, I was just about to say you fucked up the solving last time. <laughs> okay, well, you know what? This isn't even in focus. That's fine. It's on brand. Thanks, friend. <laughs> little chat. Sorry, this is like the only angle I can get in this room with my tiny tripod. Um, this is Daegu. If you're interested in like actually knowing about the city of Daegu, I did come here once and do like a more proper kind of touristy tour, but um, Daegu is a lovely little city to me because I have a dear friend that lives here and it's also just got vibes. Daegu has vibes. People are cool here. The cafe scene is nuts. Um, they just they just got the aesthetics down. Um, lovely, lovely little city. It's funny because I, I just posted this on um, Instagram, but this morning I just, I picked a random notebook to bring because I, I know that I can't journal consistently, so I just will like write in any notebook because I know it's not going to be like a multiple time thing. Um, but the notebook that I took today, I opened it and... Um, the first page was actually the day that I bought this, which was July 23rd, 2016. I was on the corner of Bleecker and Leroy Street. I believe I was in a macaron cafe. It was like the hottest summer imaginable in New York City. It was like record breaking. And I, I wrote, I don't know, <laughs> I was feeling moody, I guess. And I wrote about how would New York be New York without me? missing someone like wishing somebody was here or you know um because as much as i love new york city like it doesn't have all the people in my life that i love and i think that that's just a thing that i've <laughs> like i think we all kind of have to learn to live with is like i love soul so much but so many like probably the majority of people in my life that i love are not there and 
you know, would, would soul be soul without me, like, achingly missing people and stuff like that. And I don't know, I was just thinking about that on the bus on the way back. It has nothing to do with Daegu. I'm so sorry that that's a tangent, but I don't know what I'm trying to say. I'm tired, we were silly, and we went to a cafe and I got chamomile. So I almost like fell asleep in the cafe. <laughs> um, but yeah, I just... Daegu always makes me so moody. Like I think I'm just so, I'm so grateful to be here and I'm I'm always so happy here and like Keiko is such a wonderful friend um, that I always get really like, I don't know, like melancholy and like super emotional whenever I'm here. You can probably feel that. You can watch my other Daegu vlogs. They've always got like emo themes throughout. <laughs> so um, maybe I should end it here before it gets gets too sad yeah just sending you guys lots of love i promise tomorrow won't be moody we're going to a class um one of keiko's friends has a studio and we're going to make some personalized perfume which is very exciting and um then we're just probably gonna get ah that's what i have to do i have to figure out my train back i haven't bought my ticket so yeah i will see you guys then daegu day two Thanks for putting up with my moody, moody Daegu vlogs, <laughs> but I'll see you then. Bye. I slept like a little baby. I woke up at sunrise, gorgeous, like 6.30. And then I just was in and out of sleep um, until like nine. So I feel good. I feel very happy, rested. And now I'm just going to grab a little something to eat at a non-specific cafe, honestly, probably Starbucks, just because I need a little bit of sustenance and all the cafes I wanna go to open late on Saturdays. Um, and then we're going to go to that class. So let's make some parfum. I might, I know that I like citrus, yeah. so. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh my gosh, just endless. It smells really good. It smells really good. My little helpers. Moss? Yeah, there's moss. It's very you. Oh my gosh. Maybe, let me make sure before I find you. <laughs> Won't you like stink? Yeah, it's you. <laughs> I never took chemistry in high school, so. Multitasking. Yeah, really. <laughs> no, I am in the zone, my friend. She's doing math over here. <laughs> I will not be distracted. I know Keiko's so mean. She's not petting you. I'm sorry. <laughs> Where did the bed come from? Yeah, they brought it out. They brought it? Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> yeah, <I'll do> <laughs> You're so long. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> I wasn't making fun of you. And you're so round. You can make a, this is our CF. <laughs> I can't hold two at a time without making it look terrifying. Yeah. My hands look like claws. 
둘 다? 예. 이렇게. 아. 이렇게 이렇게. Meanwhile, I was like. <laughs> Goodbye. Goodbye. Thank you for eating my socks. <laughs>